Welcome back, I'm Martin Looker from Silicon Labs. In this third video of the Simplicity Studio series, I'll be showing you how to program demo applications into an attached dev board. The demo applications are a convenient way to explore the functionality of boards and test the example applications. I'll also be making use of the EFR Connect Bluetooth mobile application to interact with the demo. In order to give you an overview of Simplicity Studio, I will be working with an XG24 dev kit board. This board features an EFR32 MG24 multi protocol low power wireless microcontroller, which supports both Bluetooth and IEEE 802.15.4 based networks like Zigbee, Thread, and Matter. The dev kit board also includes a broad range of sensors an accelerometer, pressure sensor, relative humidity and temperature, UV and ambient light, and finally a Hall effect sensor. There are also two buttons and an RGB LED. With all these sensors, this makes a great board for prototyping. It is also expandable thanks to the quick connector that enables the use of third party boards from the likes of SparkFun and Adathroot. And you can easily access examples and drivers for these by installing the third party hardware drivers extension for Simplicity Studio. On the rear of the board, you'll find a slot for a coin cell and also a connector for an external battery. If you're creating an application where you need to move the board around, like asset tracking or motion sensing, this dev kit board will allow you to easily get started. There is an example specifically for the XG24 dev kit that I have connected, which allows exploration of many of the board peripherals over Bluetooth in conjunction with the EFR Connect mobile application. Searching for dev kit will reveal both the example and the demo options. Many of the wireless example applications require a bootloader be loaded into the device alongside the application. Viewing the project documentation will make it clear which bootloader is required and the Bluetooth demos will automatically program the, in the bootloader. If you want to explore the code and learn how the device operates, you should make use of the example project using the create button, which will create a project with code in Simplicity Studio. Alternatively, a pre-built demo can be programmed using the run button, which is what I'm doing here. Let's start EFR Connect and explore the capabilities of the dev kit demo application. The main scanning tab that you can see in the middle bottom of the screen provides a generic method to access Bluetooth devices. I can see the dev kit at the top of the list and I can make a connection to this device by using the connect button. From here, we can see all the services that are present in this device. And if we open up for more information, we can see various characteristics and read those values back. So this scan and generic GAT Explorer that we have here allows you to explore all the capabilities offered by a Bluetooth device. We also have some specific demos in the demo tab, which present a more user-friendly GUI to explore various options with the device, if the device is compatible. So for the dev kit example, this environment demo will allow us to connect to a dev kit and see all the readings that are coming back from the various sensors on the board. So if I shade the board with my hand, we can see the ambient light reading in the upper right going down in real time, and we can expose it to the light once again. Similarly, we can also make use of the magnetic sensor. If I place a magnet close to it, we can see the magnetic reading going up and down again as I move it away. This example shows you the various sensors that are on this dev kit board. With a coin cell fitted to my dev kit board, I can make use of the motion demo to take readings from the accelerometer. This particular application will show the board moving in real time as the accelerometer measurements are taken from the device. So you can see the dev kit example and demo application, if you want to make use of any of the sensors or peripherals on this board, 
you could create the example project of this and use it to explore the code and learn how to operate these peripherals. In the next video of this series, I'll create an example application with source code and show you some of the many features in Simplicity Studio that can accelerate your development. Thanks for watching.